Space, which looks completely black and empty to the eye, is actually filled with so much activity that we cannot hear or understand it. NASA's recordings from space have captured strange sounds, and after hearing them, everyone's mind is left astonished. In fact, about 44 years ago, in September 1977, NASA launched a space probe to interstellar space. This space probe is known as Voyager 1, and for the past 44 years, it has been continuously in contact with NASA's base station. The probe was sent on a mission where there was no hope of it returning. It is traveling in deep space at a speed of 6,100 km per hour and is currently sending us information about our solar system and the universe from the farthest, darkest corners of space, an area we call interstellar space. In 2012, as it entered interstellar space, NASA scientists received a signal from Voyager 1 that sent chills down their spines. When this signal was decoded, it revealed strange sounds that Voyager 1 had recorded. These sounds came from over 1.4 billion kilometers away from Earth, and they seemed to never stop or reduce. Despite waiting for several days, the sound didn't stop, and over the course of a year, it gradually decreased in intensity. This sound was the longest recorded in Voyager 1's 44-year history and had kept researchers awake at night. What's even more mysterious is that when Voyager 1 first recorded this sound, it was 1.6 billion kilometers away from its starting point, which is as far as 4,000 trips to the moon. Despite this, the sound remained the same. The distance was so vast that it left researchers perplexed about the origin of the sound. It was confirmed that there must be some powerful force beyond our solar system that was causing the sound. In space, however, there is no atmosphere or air to carry sound. For sound to be heard, there needs to be air or atmosphere, but these don't exist in space. Therefore, sound waves cannot travel through space, but electromagnetic waves can travel easily. Although our ears cannot hear these waves, Voyager 1 recorded them and sent them back to Earth for us to decode. Some scientists believe that this sound could be the result of plasma waves traveling through space, while others speculate that there may be unknown forces in deep space creating the sound. The exact cause is still unknown to us. Voyager 1 captures these waves with its antenna, converts them into radio signals, and transmits them back to Earth. Even though this signal travels at the speed of light, it takes about 21 hours for it to reach NASA's antennas on Earth. This wasn't the first time Voyager 1 sent back strange sounds. In 2007, NASA recorded some unusual signals from space that were far from normal. These sounds were so strange that they sounded like something attacking Voyager 1 with laser beams. These fast radio bursts have led scientists to believe that deep space is even more mysterious than we thought. Some researchers think that these radio bursts could originate from black holes or supernova explosions millions of light years away. Others have even speculated that extraterrestrial civilizations might be using these bursts to power their spacecraft. Whatever the case, the true nature of these strange sounds remains a mystery, and our understanding of deep space continues to evolve. Voyager 2, which was also sent to study our solar system, has also recorded some unusual sounds, including one from Jupiter's moon, Ganymede. This sound was produced by electromagnetic waves from polar lights, similar to how auroras appear on Earth. There is still much to learn about these mysterious sounds, and they continue to intrigue scientists. Voyager 1 has been sending us images and information from outer space for the past 44 years, but sadly, NASA predicts that in just one or two years, the probe will no longer be able to communicate with us due to limited power. After that, all we will have left are its photos.